this video, we're just going to learn how to create an account and log into Scratch. Um, so to get started, just to find Scratch, you could search for it in Google, or if you go to my website on the Madison Junior School page, you can go to the Resources tab, scroll down to the Computer Programming section, and then there's a link to go directly to scratch.mit.edu. Now, Scratch is a great way to get started with code. It's actually relatively powerful, despite the fact that it is a block programming language. And you could use it to create various animations, applications, games, things like that. And I do recommend you scroll through the featured project, and you'll see that there are countless varieties of things that are really incredible of what the individuals that use Scratch are able to do. Now, if you've never logged in before, you have to click on the Join Scratch, and it'll ask you to pick a username and password. When it asks you for a web or a, um, an email address, you can go ahead and use your Madison email address, and then they're going to send you a confirmation email, which you need to sign into Gmail and confirm before you're able to actually log in and share projects. Now, if you already have an account, you can just hit sign in, type in your username, and of course your password, and you should be able to sign in, and then it'll take you back to the home page. To access your documents, you can go ahead and click on your username in the top corner and then go to My Stuff, and these are where all your documents are, your projects, your studios, which is kind of like a shared network between other users, and from here you can go ahead and create a new project and get started in programming. 